You are watching Shana Renee. Yeah. And I feel like it just gives it like a little sexy touch. So this you could definitely wear for like regular class. You could wear this for a twerk outfit. Even if you want to do like learn it on the spot, figure it out on the spot. And then as soon as they like right, get on stage to practice, we got to make sure we know what we're doing and don't mess it up. And I'm going to speak to you about like a lot of factual stuff and also just stuff that is what I do or my advice. Hey, gang, gang. I know you don't know me, I don't know you, but can you do my hair? Can you do black girl's hair? You just never know. And you could possibly get fired from a job. So it was like nine o'clock. We had to be ready by 9.45. And when I say ready by 9.45, not finishing at 9.45, ready and dressed at 9.45, ready. All right, so I did not record anything else because it's been a crazy morning. I had a lot to like do and try to make sure I had all my stuff together. So I'm walking to, I'm sorry if it's so loud, but it's New York City. I'm gonna wait to this train pass. All right, anywho. Um, yeah, I had so much to do. I couldn't even record. I had to like post uh, my pictures or post certain things that I need to get out in a certain time. So that was a lot. Uh, my hair looks nuts right here under this because I didn't really get to do it, to be honest. So hopefully I get to do it before I do run through on stage because I'm gonna be upset. If not, um, I'm gonna show you again, but this is what I decided to wear for the rehearsal on stage. I do have on um, black leggings underneath, just in case anything. Nobody cares about the color, but just in case I have black one underneath. Um, I'm about to head to the hotel because we have to meet at four. Uh, then stage, we have stage rehearsal at 4.30. And yeah, from there, Hair and makeup at six. I'm guessing get dressed like a little bit after that, maybe around eight or nine, because then we perform around 10. I definitely wasn't paying attention and I walked all the way around and got trapped in some barricades. So now I gotta walk around. There definitely was a lot going on. Look at this elevator. Anyway, they blocked off all of the streets. So I had to walk all the way down and around just to get into the hotel. And then, I don't know if they stopped the COVID testing, but I had to find the people like walking out of the room, like in the hallway, just to get my tests and badge stuff. God is good, y'all. God is good. Y'all, I didn't think I was gonna to like perform like do my staging. And my hair is probably looking crazy under this hat. I'm tight, but it's all good. It's all good. It's gonna get fixed. Don't worry. This is a rehearsal outfit with the shoes. So we're outside in our little cubicle, just waiting to perform, getting a little stretch on. Yeah, everybody's getting a stretch on <laughs> in this little spot, but it's work we're working it out. What happened? You can go to the stage. Oh, boom. Hi, thank you. Look at the stage, y'all. Just so you know. Yes, sir. This is as good as this goes down. It okay. Is taped down, but so this just mine be careful. Oh mine God! Edges. Oh, this part. Wow. It is taped down, but again, this mine the edges okay. that you don't trip so or be careful. A Meaning, don't go full out on that part. Right. Got exactly. it. <laughs> right. Hold it real steady. How do y'all feel? Feel amazing. Woo! 
Yo, I just want to say thank God because he did this. He did this. Next year, I'm going to be up there. What up? This is it. This is the line. This is the stage. There's a little bit of wet spot, so definitely got to watch out for those. This is a little bit bigger than what we probably imagined, so that's great. Definitely enough for four dancers. So update, I am not wearing my hair like this anymore. I have to take my hair out. My hair is in twist underneath this, so yeah. And I might have to get a flat iron. So that's about to be a lot, but I'm like, oh, we're about to go do this. Alrighty, let's get it. good i'm just thinking about the whole flat iron possible flat ironing process and i'm wondering if i could keep some twist in the middle like still twisted yeah. so it's easier to keep some of my hair slick so that's what i'm trying to like figure that out Y'all, I know it's like it's like blurry over here, but I'm like a little tight because I had to take out my hair, like, and my hair is thick. I can't really see, but my hair is super thick. I gotta try to flat iron it or fake a flat iron. I was trying to not put heat to my hair, but my pony is not gonna last or look good on stage, so I gotta do what I gotta do. But like, this is stressful. Um. I'm gonna try to, I took it out myself. I told the stylist that I will flat iron it myself. So yeah, I'm gonna go do that. Hopefully I have enough time to rehearse and just do whatever I need to do. So I'm gonna go do that before I start going crazy. So yeah, there's just a lot with the hair last minute. I had to take out my clips and then take out my twist. And then even with the whole, um, the rape thing and just having the information late is just a lot of back and forth running around and yeah i'm gonna go and finish this and then i'll come back with any other news it's not gonna be bone straight just to let you know no honey okay because oh, no. it'll take a lot for my hair to get there it's gonna be like probably like do you think using um water for your hair is probably best to get that real slick if you use water, you gotta use a lot of gel on top of it because my hair is gonna it's start gonna to stay curly. It's gonna, that was gonna puff up like. So if you do what use water, it can definitely help. So maybe I don't have to fly. Is that what you suggested? That's what I'm trying to get at. Yeah. Yes. So that way it's less damage to your hair. Because um, believe it or not, I'm I like appreciate a wavy, you, curly man. girl. Like I feel that. So if you think the water is gonna be good, just and... drench my whole head in water and. Suck it up. Hey, that's what she said. I'm with it. I'm I'm I'm, I'm with it because I really didn't want to have to fly. I know. I feel bad, and you're doing it and you're stupid. Don't do that. We'll do it away. That's what she said. And then your bun is just gonna be a little poof, and I can put um a hairnet to kind of keep it under control, and then just well, like, we can throw this. Oh, you want to do the yeah, extensions we, in that? Yeah, you could put that as the bun. Well, okay. Cool. So, so we'll take out the rest of these twists then. Or, no, I think I'm going to leave these twists in here and put the, wet, the rest wet. I'm going to wet it for you when I'm ready for you. 
So in the meantime, I'm gonna do her hair. Mm -hmm. You chill. That's fine. I can put on my I can put on my press ons. Boom. Done. She ate that. Honestly, I appreciate that because y'all. She ate that. Is that cool? She ate that. I'm hype. I'm hype. I'm hype. I'm hype. So I'ma just the tangleless thing. Now, y'all, we still have the same. Trying to get it down to my bra strap. Let's go. Slickity, 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 slickity. Slickity, slickity, I performed ah, in Times Square for New Year's. For the new year, I'm mad excited. I feel super good about it and I'm hyped. Um, ah, I guess I'll, uh, I'll talk to you guys um, later about like the process of getting to this point because it was a lot going on before I got on stage like so much. Um, yeah, so. I'm gonna definitely do that and I think I'm gonna stay tuned for my YouTube channel on my other channel which is Miss Kisses Reacts. I'm gonna be reacting to the performance on that channel so definitely stay tuned for that and I'm gonna get you out a little bit later because I'm about to go try to take some pictures. <sighs> Thank you God. Freaking 2021. I am super blessed to see a new year. And yeah, like, thank you, God. Thank you, baby Jesus. I'm blessed and highly favored. Thank you. Um, oh, yo, I'm so on a high. Like, I'm so on a high. But, um, so I'm gonna either finish this video out today or tomorrow. I don't know. But, I'm just super excited, still excited. My nails, they stayed on. I'm hyped, these are press on. Like, I need to get another set of these, these are good. 
Um, I did it like a little bit before the performance. You know? There was a lot going on today. Some I'm gonna get into, some I'm gonna not get into, but y'all, every job is not easy. Every job is not smooth. And yeah, this is one of those jobs for this job, but it was still all good, still grateful for it. Um, yeah. I hope y'all can hear me. So as soon as I got to the hotel, mind you, they said we had to be there at four. And then they said we had to be there, like we'll walk into stage at 4.30. So I got there on time and it took me a while because like they closed down all of um, 6th and 7th Avenue and you had to walk all the way around and down to get to where you need to get to. So that took me a while. So when I got in the hotel and I got to the person uh, to do my COVID test me. It was like what, 4.03 by that time? So that I was trying to find them, so I ended up finding them, maybe like 4.10. And as that happened, they were already walking to stage, so. Crazy, like, I don't know. They, they like, yeah, I thought we would have like that 30 minutes to chill and then walk to stage, but we walked straight to stage. All right, y'all, I have no idea where I left off with that last video clip, whatever clip I did. So yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna say what I need to say from what I have in my head. Um, I know that, what do I know? I don't even, my brain is like fried right now. Let's, let's, let's bring it back, let's bring it back, 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 the back. Ah, stage rehearsal was good. Uh, everybody who was there was super, super sweet, super, super nice. Everybody who was there in the little bubble was tested for COVID, so we was good. Even if we didn't wear our mask, we were good or whatever. Um, but we did wear our mask, right? We wore the mask. Anyway, so yeah, stage rehearsal was good. Um, the floor was like a little bit wet because it was raining a little bit, but um, we that was our first time practicing in our heels, so we had to kind of break them in. Luckily, they were like chunky heels, so that was good. It was cold. It wasn't like freezing cold, thank God. But it was cold. We ran it like what two, three times back to back, two, three times back to back. Boom, we were done. We went to go eat. During us eating, it was the four of us girls, Pisces gang gang. I don't know if I mentioned that before, but all four of us are Pisces, and we are very extremely similar, which is crazy. But anyway, um, we were sitting down eating, just talking about different things, and I'm not gonna get into what we were talking about, but there was definitely a part um a point in time where we were just talking about like you know things that we were grateful for and how life has went and is going now and what we see for ourselves in the future and like just that part was just amazing to me so, yeah i just thought it was like an amazing conversation that just sparked up out of nowhere and i'm just happy we had that so i just think that was just a beautiful moment and i just want to say that but anyway so after we ate we went to hair and makeup um the person who did our hair was Harley, and then honestly, I forgot what the lady name is who did our makeup, but it's all good. I'm gonna put their links here or whatever the case is, or down below so you can see. So with the whole hair situation, that was just a lot going on, and I was like so tight about it because as a black girl, it's super super hard for people to for 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 me, and I know most black girls, it's super super hard for us to be like, all right. I'm gonna trust you with my hair. I know you don't know me, I don't know you, but can you do my hair? Can you do black girl's hair? Can you do black girl's hair that's curly? Wait, hold up, can you do black girl hair that's very, very tight, kinky, curly, and not let it fall off? And that's usually like sometimes like a big thing, a big issue, and not everybody can do that. Now with this hairstylist, she was very knowledgeable about hair, and I didn't like already judge her like, oh, she don't know what to do, but in my head I was like, okay, I'm gonna probably do it, let her do my ponytail for me or whatever because as you've seen the last minute that they were like oh everybody's not wearing their own hair everybody needs to look together <sighs> took out my twist or whatever and as i was um detangling my hair i was like dang so now i got a flat on it for her to go for it to go up in a bun luckily the hair stylist she was like yo Instead of you flat ironing, flat ironing it, why don't you just wet it so that way it could be sleek? And I was just like, yo, that's amazing. That's such a great idea. And I'm so glad and grateful for her to think about that 
So she said, let's do that. I did that. I was like, yo, let's actually put conditioner in my hair because I know conditioner will help it slick. So I just re-slicked it, but this is still a bun. Slicked it up. Boom, boom, boom. She did it. I'm hype. And then she just put my uh, clippings that I had in earlier uh, just for the top of my bun because my bun would have not looked like anything. Because when my hair is wet, it shrinks. So I'm luckily, I'm luckily I had this hair with me, so that was cool the only thing that i did not like and that i was like stressing out about is the lady who was the makeup artist now before y'all anybody tries to be messy we spoke about this her and i spoke about it real quick so i'm not even talking about how she already know i already spoke to her about it specifically she took a while to do the other girl's makeup now it's normal for you know makeup artists to take a while to take their time to make sure everybody faces be so i'm looking at the time and i'm like yo Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. I don't even know if I have time to like rehearse. I don't have time to do I rehearsed a little bit, but between me, I put on my nails, which didn't take that long. And between me having to take out my hair and um what's it called? I took out my hair, I took out the the tracks, the clippings, I I had to uh detangle it. All of that took a while because my hair is thick and my hair don't play. Like it's gonna be messed up and it's gonna look trash if I don't do that. So I had to do that and that took up basically most of the time. I did try to stop and you know take a second to rehearse or whatever and throw these on real quick. But that whole time, the artist was working on the other girl's face, doing her thing. It came out beautiful. But so then it was like nine o'clock. We had to be ready by 9.45. And when I say ready by 9.45, not finishing at 9.45, ready and dressed at 9 45 ready to get ready to go to stage because we're performing at 10 15 so we need to be downstairs inside the holding area to get up on stage by 10 so you know there was like maybe three times i kind of like without saying like hey look at the time do my face or whatever because i don't know her and i don't know what the energy was going to be depending on how i delivered it but i was just like oh, okay how long would you be you know finished with the this is the last person before me how long are you gonna finish with her or whatever the case and this was like nine something she's like oh 15 minutes when i was like oh, okay because you know we gotta get ready soon so i'm just trying to see how much time i have to like rehearse and then just be, be prepared for you which i was already prepared for her but that was me just saying look at the time like we gotta go so then she ain't take the bait for that what bro what are you talking about man then I said something else. I try to say it loud so everybody could hear, so they could all like probably answer. Something about the time again, it was like, oh, are they coming back? What time are they coming back to get us dressed? Or whatever, and somebody's like, no, we have to be dressed by 9.45. Cool. She still ain't take that as a thing. Boy, if you don't- So then the man, a manager, the, the manager came out, came in. He seen me with no face or whatever the case is, and it was like literally at nine, 20 9 20 so he left and he came right back so then this other girl who was doing a lot of errands running back and forth she came and she was like all right i'm gonna start your face so then now i'm kind of mom gonna hold you i'm a little annoyed because i'm like yo i'm about to have an ugly face on stage i'm about to look nuts and i'm gonna be the only dancer up there looking nuts and i'm the only black girl so i'm the only black girl up there looking nuts i'm not gonna be happy with that so that was in my head and i kept saying like not because I didn't think she could do makeup, it's just because it was gonna be a rush job and I'm like, they're gonna have to probably skip steps. So that's what it was kind of making me like a little bit annoyed, but I kept trying to be positive about it. Kept trying, 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 trying. Keyword trying. So it was like, in, like, you know, in and out, up and down, whatever. So, um, yeah, so she starts, so she's like, oh, I'm gonna start my face. And then the other lady was like, oh, I'm done with her. So I sit in the chair, I'm like, all right, so now she's still gonna have to rush my face. Now, this is what made me really start freaking out. Both of them doing my face at the same time. Never heard of it, never seen it, never wanted it, not me. So I was like, are you serious? Are you serious? This is Now I'm really about to look crazy. So all I, all I feel is this and this and this and one is poking and one is brushing and one is pushing and one is patting and one is tapping and one is plumping like it was just like it just felt like because i can't see it it just felt like somebody's gonna mess up because it's something whatever whatever the case is the whole thing that was annoying us about it is i know as soon as i get up from the chair i'm not gonna have time to stretch anymore 
I'm not gonna have time to try to take little quick pictures. I'm not gonna have time to just relax for a second. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna go ready. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Of course, Bobby. Bobby. and like you know calm myself none of that i'm gonna have to brush and get ready and dress that's exactly what happened so they finish boom lashes on as i'm doing i'm like oh my god i gotta go change into my performance underwear then I have to pee. so as i'm doing that the lady's coming in the room in the bathroom with the outfit so i'm stepping in the outfit while i'm trying to put in my earrings and they trying to dress me as i'm trying to get myself together and i'm just like now I'm feeling a little bit flustered and I like the whole time I kept telling myself I forgot to add aside from that I didn't want it to seem like I was the one who was taking Madelon to get ready because if the artist is ready to go on stage they should never be waiting for the dancer you should always be waiting for the artist so that was also adding to my flusteration <laughs> I just made that up but y'all get it so like Shayna I understand that whatever's happened was that is done don't be flustered so that was happening. I ended up looking in the mirror. I'm like, oh, snap. My face looks good. They ate this. You couldn't even tell it was a half and half situation. Like, literally, foundation was only on one side. My eyes were being done. Powder, eyebrows, switched. Eyes, foundation. So literally, it was half and half the whole time. Like, I wish I could have recorded the whole thing, but it was too much to record. I recorded a little bit at the end, which I'll probably show or I've shown already. But it was just a lot and i was just like thank god my face is good in that whole time we still were going back i forgot to mention we were still going back and forth about wearing the air muffs because these air muffs look at them they're cute i love it I, we all wish we could have wore them but baby it would have fell down you seen you seen the moves if you didn't see it go check it out check out the video or you could go to my Reaction page. You can go to my reaction page, Miss Kisses Reacts, where I just reacted to seeing myself and the girls perform for the first time for real, for real. So you can go see that. Everybody's eating these steps. But for me in this part, brain, gang, crack, full out, eh, ate that. They can let's eat. Walk, walk, walk. Ate it, yo. So yeah, there was just like a lot going on. The, we, they were trying to see how we could tack the headbands on. It's like, yo, we told y'all already. We tried to give alternate um, things. We tried to send pictures of stuff that was probably accessible or a little easier to find that we could do instead because we couldn't wear, like, it would have looked crazy. We all would have looked nuts on stage because it's the first step, it would have flew up. I promise you would have flew up. So luckily, they asked the um, hairstylist, like, oh, well, what do you think? Is there any way we can X, Y, and Z? And luckily, she understood and she was like, yo, there's honestly no way to make this look good. Boom, Head, headphones, headphones, what do you call? Earmuffs gone, we didn't have to use them. Happy about that. That's out of here. Um, the outfits, I think I spoke about it in the last clip. Hopefully I did, because I'm not gonna fully get into it. The outfits, the out, blah, blah, blah. these outfits, they fit better. They um, look better. And honestly, the only thing about the outfit was it was just a little bit tight in the arms and a little bit tight in the crotch. So anytime I bend down, it was kind of like just pulling up. So it was just a lot of stuff like, you know, with my agent and them trying to get the right information. That was just a lot going back and forth, making sure that it's like, yo, I need to have something to send my agent. There needs to be something solid, something concrete. But luckily my agent kind of like helped me out and figured that out. Thank you, Claire Talent Group. Chase, thank you for working with me trying to figure that out. Um, What else is there? Leaving the um stage they were like trying to rush us to be like all right let's go let's go let's go let's go leave and it's just like well we didn't understand why because you know it was over or whatever you want to celebrate whatever so at first we didn't even get to get no pictures taken so we was like dang we can get no pictures blah, blah, blah. and you already know how it is with people in pictures and social media like that's what we live for that's what not live for but you know what i mean that's what we need for our gram for our booking for our this for our that you know what i mean so yeah so that was a little sucky so we was in the hotel and like what 10 minutes passed we were you know talking to each other being grateful whatever watched like a few little clips here and there and then we were like yo like nobody hit us up about the outfits nobody told us where to leave or where to put it or whatever everybody else was just like gone so 
we actually got to keep the outfit like the whole entire outfit which is crazy and which is rare sometimes you get to keep, keep pieces here and there but we got to keep the whole entire outfit and i went outside and i was talking on the phone and i passed the stylist and he was like oh my god you guys are great he didn't say nothing so i'm like okay i guess we keep an outfit so we kept the outfits on and we were like yo let's try to go back we have on the outfit so they can't really tell us no let's try to go back and let's try to go get some pictures gracious to god they let us go through we took some pictures we had fun we vibed out ah, 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 all of that but the only thing is when j-lo started to perform which was a few minutes before the countdown ended i mean started they were like everybody chill out so with, this was sucky so we didn't even get to watch the ball drop like right in front of the ball we were standing in front of the hotel which is like literally right there we were standing in front of the hotel saying happy new year three two one that was mad trash we were so upset about it but overall it was still good uh still did the countdown i didn't record that because i was on facetime um and that was more important than being like oh recording it i'm like maybe i'll get a clip from somebody else or whatever i don't know after i did go oh happy new year whatever but yeah so that's how that kind of ended and it was just like an abrupt up oh, shows all right i read leave go home whatever so ball drop say hey, happy new year da, da, da. literally put on my stuff i was still outside i didn't feel like going back upstairs so i put on my like my sweatpants and all that over my stuff and i like literally trucked it to the um long island railroad and that's basically it so yeah whenever i get booked you're gonna see more of these videos i do have some that i haven't put out from it's maybe not i don't think it's this detailed into everything but i am like showing like you know certain things for rehearsal when i was on tour and all that stuff so god willing i'll find those videos and like actually put them together for you well for you and for me and for whoever wants to see it but i definitely want to do a lot more of these videos where I'm showing some of the in and outs of, you know, the dancers and dance industry and rehearsals, whatever. Um, I can't get fully, fully OD, like deep into it or be, or have the camera out all the time because everybody's not with that and you shouldn't be recording and just putting up everything because you just never know. And you could possibly get fired from a job. So you don't want to do that. Thank you guys for watching this vlog style video. I appreciate it. And I will try to upload as much as I can and upload more as soon as I get a better setup. This is a new setup. Let's see if this works. I don't know. But thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Later. So she said.